Yeah. What's up, Lena babies? It's your girl Selena Corinne here. We are back with another vloggy vlog. If you are new, hey girl, hey, hey boy, hey, however you define yourself as, go ahead and click that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and press the notification bell if you are not new. Hey, Lena babies, I miss you. So, y'all, it is the next day after Christmas. And like I said, this is the last time y'all gonna hear me saying it because y'all just gonna see it, but y'all getting a lot of vlogs. So that means I gotta pick up the camera and record for y'all. So it is currently like a little bit afternoonish, and I'm actually about to make me an acai bowl. If you know, you know that's one of your girl's favorite thing to eat for breakfast now i actually need to get some more but we'll probably get that later on in the week it's monday we'll probably get that by thursday or something get myself a little break from it i'm about to go ahead and make me some breakfast and then we're gonna get ready and all that in a little bit i need to work on my website like i said um if you have not watched my previous vlogs make sure you go check up on that but like i said i am about to be launching my graphic design business so i just have a few more things that i need to put on my website and you guys will see that i got a, um, a little bit more graphics i need to make to add on to my projects list and just revamp some things i've been looking at like youtube videos of how other graphic designers and just entrepreneurs all around do their videos or do their um websites and stuff like that so do their videos but do their videos too because i'll be looking at them doing my videos as well doing their websites for their business especially launch day i just want everything to go smooth the first is on a sunday so i'm probably not going to announce my actual official launch like i'm going to give like hey it's launch but the actual grand launch is probably going to be january 4th i don't know just stay tuned because you guys obviously see that in the vlog the launch day vlog and everything like that but yeah i'm about to go ahead and make me some breakfast and then create some graphics and stuff for my website and then you guys will see the motivational talk on it so make sure i click the subscribe button and let's get into the vlog <laughs> All right, y'all, so it has been a little while um, since I've seen you guys. It's currently like almost 4 p.m. And I kind of lost track of time. Like I was supposed to be getting ready and everything. I'm not going anywhere, but just like freshen up and things like that. But I just kind of like got lost in the time working on my business and stuff as far as like my graphic design 
and planning content out for y'all and just getting things set up. I'm not gonna go into detail. I will go into detail once I have completed it and everything, but I was just, you know, just talking to God um, in spirit and things like that. And just, I really just want what God wants for me, y'all. Um, as you guys know, most of you guys may know that I rebranded my YouTube channel. So um, before I was into like worldly things, drinking and all that. And then I just cut it out because I just obviously know that that's not what God wants for me and what I should, like I shouldn't be doing that and stuff like that. So I wanted to come on here as our daily motivational talk and Bible talk. And I just wanna encourage somebody, anything you may be going through in life, you know, like I say all the time, it's easy for us to get into our own heads and, you know, allow the enemy or even your flesh just to discourage you. Depression and anxiety rises, falls, rises all the time. So it's just best to always just seek God. And it doesn't have to look like everybody else. What God wants for you is a genuine relationship. So how you can easily call your mom or your siblings or your best friend or whatever and just tell them about your day, tell them how you feel and tell them how that scenario made you feel is literally how you can talk to God. You can sit here and just start talking. He wants a relationship with you. He doesn't want religion where it's like, okay, I'm only going to talk to him when I wake up or when I'm going to sleep and that's it. Like that's not a real relationship. And you will start to see things become different in your life when you treat God as an actual relationship and not just somebody that you feel like you have to talk to or you're just going to be condemned to hell. Another thing that I want to say is to have that perspective of he is your father. So how you, if you have kids or you know you have a father, a parent figure in your life, how you come to them about your problems or what you need in life, whether it's, for example, a textbook for school or some new shoes, or you want to talk to them about how your siblings made you feel and things like that. Put it in your mind that God is your father. He is your heavenly father. He cares about you. He already knows what's on your heart and what's on your mind. He just wants to see if you care about him enough to bring your problems to him and cast your worries and things that may be hindering you from trying to get to that relationship perspective that you are trying to get to with God. Seek the kingdom of God above all else and live righteously and he will give you everything you need. So don't worry about tomorrow for tomorrow will bring its own worries. Today's trouble is enough for today. And I wanna reread that again. And I, I really just wanna read verse 34 and I'm putting it on the screen right here. It says, so don't worry about tomorrow for tomorrow will bring its own worries. Today's trouble is enough for today. And that speaks to me a lot because I tend to be like, say for instance, my check was unexpectedly short and I'm just like, okay, how am I going to do this? And the bill is like seven, eight days away. And I'm not even focusing on what I need to do today, like my priorities and things that I need to do today to take care of what I do have in control. And God is going to make a way. So when I read this, I think to myself, don't even worry about tomorrow. The bill is due seven days, but don't even, don't even worry about tomorrow because tomorrow has its own worries. You're just going to keep creating this overwhelming feeling in you, like, you know, in your mental and things like that when all you got to do is just trust in God. And y'all, I'm telling you, I am a witness. Every time I put something in God's hands and just let it go, he provides every single time. And I just want to encourage y'all, whatever you feel like you're going through in life, that you just feel like it's just too impossible to just get over and get through. Just remember, nothing is impossible for God. He can make anything impossible turn to possible because he is God. That's the motivational Bible talk for today. Um, I'm actually about to go ahead and finish up some more graphics, just trying to get it prepped and everything for a launch day. Um, in the middle of me actually working on like my graphic designs, I just like looked over my website and seen that I need to add a little bit more stuff on there and things like that. So 
I'm just about to work on the agreement contracts. Um, I got some clients who just DM me and things like that. So I'm about to work with them, see what they're needing, pricing and all that. But next time I will see you all will probably be when I'm getting ready, like just freshening up and everything like that. If you have not seen like that skincare routine, definitely work. I'm gonna show y'all when I'm in like better lighting, but the skincare routine that I showed y'all on my last vlog, definitely work for your girls so we're gonna be doing that again today y'all so i am out the shower um i just honestly put this on my head i don't know why but my braids is like sticking up as y'all can see so this is helping it kind of like lay down how it wants to be i got this from belvo um i'll try to remember and put them in the link description but they're a makeup company um based in atlanta and this is like one of the freebies I got in my packaging and stuff. But yeah, let's talk real quick before I close out this vlog. So I don't remember what vlog it was. I don't remember what vlog it was, but um, I was telling y'all that one of the things that I wanted to do better for 2023 is to be better with my finances. And then I told y'all I had got a budget book. I also unboxed this budget book like a while ago maybe in september in one of my vlogs when i went out to eat and all that you guys have to go find it and, and just watch for your girl but i had unboxed this and i got this from amazon and it was no more than ten dollars because if you know you know your girl don't play that i ain't i ain't gonna spend too much especially on something that i can color i probably can't i probably can't i don't know but this was off of amazon and i'm gonna go to some pages I haven't written in so y'all don't see my finances and stuff but I wanted to just show this to y'all in case there's somebody out there who is looking for a budget book or something like that um to help with you know better finances and all that just jazz but let me see um okay so this is how it starts off so you have like the month and you can put like the notes that you want to accomplish or whatever notes that you need to have like don't forget this month doctor's appointment whatever like literally any type of notes that you will put on an actual calendar on the side and so right here i would put like january 2023 and then i would put the days of the week so i would put in this little box like one two three four y'all y'all not slow y'all know what i'm talking about and so that's that paper then the next one it has a monthly plan so it gives you four goals to accomplish which ones you want to do and then also back here i'm gonna show y'all more of this but i created envelopes because i do want to do like um the cash stuffing envelope things which i'll probably start putting that in my vlogs not like just separate vlogs but just showing y'all segments of how i manage my money because y'all we gonna get this okay and so these are all the envelopes of every expense that i have including like entertainment shopping gas phone bill whatever and it also includes these stickers as well so i said this to say like as far as the goals it'll have stickers like um debit paid sinking funds whatever the case may be like i'll just put the sticker right there and then it has upcoming purchases so if it's not usually like a every month type of thing but this specific month say this is when your credit bill credit card bill is due every three months and this is the month so upcoming purchases because you're going to need to know the extra expenses upcoming bills it gives you a tracker of like your income right here and then you can add it up and put the total and then savings like how much did you save for that month and then over here is where you can put all of your category and expenses so like right here 
it'll be um like rent the budgeted say your rent is 500 but you didn't include the fees like if you pay online and they have a four dollar fee so it'll be 504 so the difference was 504 dollars and then you can add it all up at the bottom and it gives you um expense tracker as well so every time you purchase something which i need to buy this person once i do i'm gonna show y'all like what type of purse it is and why i want it so bad but literally every single time you spend some type of money you need to put it right here and so um like january 14th i did doordash category other or food and then the amount and so that way you can keep track of all that you had spent that month then at the end it says uh, monthly budget review so where did i have the most trouble what could i improve this month and what goals can i set for the next month right here so as you see i have been like writing in it but i haven't kept up the way i should so that's definitely gonna start january 2023 and I just want to basically be better with like finances and everything like that. So yeah, y'all, if y'all are looking for some type of budget book, check out Amazon. Amazon is literally my go-to. And then your girl, y'all see that, right? But I still have like a planning content calendar, which I think I showed you this like plenty of times, but I need to start planning more content in here. This goes all the way to June 2023, so. Yeah, y'all. But all right, y'all, I'm about to close out this vlog. I will be starting up another vlog tomorrow because me and Bay do have some errands that we need to run. I am basically just vlogging like every day, anytime. I pick up the camera or anytime I just feel like I'm doing something that is worth vlogging like today it wasn't much but I was doing graphics and stuff like that so I wanted to show y'all me prepping for launch day and all that so I'll be seeing y'all in the next vloggy vlog make sure y'all give this video a thumbs up press the subscribe button and give that bell a ring a ding ding and I will see y'all in the next vlog bye the when all I ever think about is you